Today, the Novartis Foundation for Sustainable Development has announced a new strategy in the fight against leprosy. This new strategy will involve contact tracing, and that is every new patient uh, with leprosy will be uh, contacted in terms of proactively, uh, prophylactically treating those people around them, up to 20 people, which we believe will be a new uh, way to end leprosy in the world. So it's really this comprehensive view that starts with assessing the real feasibility. Is it really the moment now to go towards elimination? Or should I just remain within uh, the context of control? That means reducing burden. So this is actually a choice which is not a, a technical choice, it's also a societal choice to invest in eliminating a disease and therefore setting a priority which has at the short run a huge cost but can have after a lot of benefits later on. I gave the keynote speech at the seminar on what next to eradicate and my caution was no disease now warrants a time limited eradication commitment. That we simply do not have the tools, we do not have the support, we do not have in anywhere close to what we have with smallpox. But disease elimination by countries would make sense and eventually we may be in the position then of saying we've eradicated it worldwide. The elimination of leprosy as a public health program problem remains a priority of the federal government in Brazil. If we eliminate leprosy, it will be a very important contribution to reduce extreme, extreme poverty in Brazil. If our ambition is to uh, achieve elimination, in other words, move towards um, reducing transmission, we have to do something new. We can't keep on doing the same things. We've got to look at innovations and that's what we want to have a look at this afternoon. So we need new mechanism. We need to deliver them in a single dose um, from a compliance perspective and from a management of the risk of drug resistance. It's a huge advantage and having the ability to deliver single dose cure would be possibly a game changer. Uh, what we do with this symposium is to convene a lot of stakeholders and multidisciplinary teams, in fact, because we think that in the context of uh, global health in the 21st century, there is not one uh, health problem that can be um, answered to by a single player. You need to have a multidisciplinary approach. And we hope that there's going to be a lot of exchange, and that's why uh, we have this big group of people here together. What we have in Malawi can be shared with the, the rest of uh, uh, the countries. And this symposium is actually an eye-opener on what is happening in various uh, countries. We need all to get together and sometimes it's not easy to try to speak the same language. I, we are all meaning at the same thing. It's just the detail that are sometimes a little bit different and we should agree about that. I think that sort of meeting could, could by putting together people of different background, give a, a real boost. Equally important is you as a country have to put in more resources and not just to be on the receiving end. So other countries have to learn from that. What I find important is a realization that you don't just, drugs is one thing that is very important and crucial, but if you're going to have a public health approach to issues of eradicating or eliminating diseases, you have to have a view which is, you know, a, a global. Leprosy gave me really a perspective. I really like the presentation in, uh, on Brazil, what they are doing with the students, children, so I really find it very useful. Um, I really like also the Namibia uh, Ministry of Health uh, to show that he can drive from his area, Sadak region, drive uh, from the south to the north. And just to see the whole context uh, was really very valuable to me. We, we just look at a very, very tiny part of the whole thing. We're the magic bullet team, if you like, but to see the whole problem uh, and all the related pieces was brilliant. It, it makes what we do um, feel so much more important. We don't have the time every day to um, de delve into such, de uh, such areas, but having a symposium such as this can allow us to increase and enhance our knowledge.